Hello, my name is Chen Yuwa, project ID CA19059. Now I'm presenting the project part 1 case study. Food Panda is an online food ordering website that active in the Malaysian with the marketplace headquartered in Berlin, Germany. Food Panda website is an online food ordering service and we send the food order through delivery. In the food ordering process, the system will ask the information from the users about destination of the delivery, quantity of order and also some of the vital details. The most important part of Food Panda reservation system is its search functionality that enables to find out several locations. Hello, my name is Chen Yuwa, my text ID is CA19059. Now I will start presenting the project part 1. In the project part 1, we need to list down the functional and also the non-functional requirement. In the functional requirement, my point is cancellation order. It means that the customer can cancel the order after the payment has been done with the 100% refund of the origin price. Okay, my next point is the payment or transaction. Customer can pay their orders through the online payment like the debit and credit card and also the online banking like Maybank to you and etc. by filling all the details to proceed to the payment. Assalamualaikum, my name is Ahmad Zakwan Jazmi, metric number CD10067. In the functional, my point is the customers must be register a food panda account if he or she wants to order the food. The unregistered user can go for ordering. As point is, customers can log in by entering email address and password and manage their work on the website. My name is Benedict Ho Nai, matrix ID CA19109. My first point is customers should enter their full address or location before they order food from Food Panda so that the food they had been ordered will be delivered to them. My second point is those who are interested to join Food Panda delivery team, they can apply at Food Panda website. They need to choose what city they are and choose their type of Berhinker. Then they have to fulfill their personal details. Good day to Dr. Fauzian. My name is Lim Jian Chang, metric number CA19110. For the functional requirement for Food Panda website, the customer can select a food item, what they want, and add into the cart, and then they can place the order and get confirmation about the order in the form of the order number. The picture is the screen capture of the how customer add the food they want into the cart. Next is customer can check the status of his order by using the Food Panda website. Here is the screen picture on how customer track their order. Warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Ahmad Ali Muhammad. I will present here. I will presentation about the uh, functional. The first uh, customer can can get any help how to use app uh, by click uh, help center. The second uh, customer. Uh, can invite uh, anyone uh, to to join uh, and start order uh, by click uh, invite uh, invite friends. For the non-functional requirement, my point may be the receipt. The food handle website will generate and send the receipt to the customer through the email in a report form. In the non-functional, my point is availability. The system should be accessible consistently, which means the client can get to it utilizing an internet browser. My non-functional point is customer can solve their problem they face or change their account detail through the help center. Then Choose my account. For the non-functional requirement for the Foodpanda website, the system should request the current password from the user so they can change to the new password on the Foodpanda account. Here is the screen capture of the website. Request the current password so we can change to the new password for our Foodpanda account. Non-functional, the system should out added, uh, added together 
the ATM uh, price inside the car cart before check. Case study part two. This project part two is more focused on environment of Food Panda website system. The color of Food Panda website system is pink. Every information is easily browsed and portray accurate information and systematic as list like food ordering, pricing, location offer, and other valid and useful information. The website is clearly show the foods and service offer as it refer to the availability of the company. For the API part, the Food Panda website had a lot of API that had a uh, ability to receive customer feedback through this application 24 hours per day. For the user interface design principal parts, my point will be user familiarity. The Food Panda website system looks familiar and easy to use by the customer for ordering the food will be the consistency, the arrangement of the food list and place and or location in the food panda website system is systematic and also tidy and the most important part is the color of the food panda website interface which is pink in color which will make the customer more appetizing. User interface design principle, my point is minimum price. The user should never be shocked by the conduct of the food panda system. If a command works in a known manner, the user should be able to predict the operation of practically identical orders. For example, users can predict which page will be redirected after they press any of the functions. Recoverability Food Panda websites should include magazine to allow users to recover from errors. For example, customer can remove their order from cart before they do payment. Next is user guidance. The Food Panda website has provided the user guide for the instruction on using the Food Panda website, show how the Food Panda works, and guide the user step by step to using the Food Panda website. And the Food Panda website also provided the help system and reference for the problem they're facing by using the Food Panda, like the problem of the user account, the payment, and place order, and more. Here is the screen capture of the guidance of Food Panda and the help center of Food Panda. Interface design when regards to Food Panda, you need to choose the the country from the list shown in the finger to specify your country and all the registration details on the other hand food benta has one feature that alone anyone to apply to join the deliver team watch you need to choose the air and the tips of the uh, figure from the last list as shown in the finger okay now we will be presenting the api part the first api will be the malaysian food panda website api in the api my point is google places api Food Panda Total Payment API. This API is specially designed to calculate total payment for customer or client. Of the API for the Food Panda website is the Facebook Login API. Uh, the Food Panda website has provided the account login by using Facebook Login and can receive the personal data such as profile picture and the email address from the Facebook account we used to sign into Food Panda website. Here is the screen capture on the Food Panda request the name and the profile picture and email address to use in the Food Panda website. Google Maps EBI Food Panda provide Google Maps EBI which help the user to choose in the exactly location which they can edit in the straight name or move the map to the correct location as shown in finger. 
solution for the part one and the part two is the user interface. The changes are needed for the patenting into appearing the 3D image for more attraction and make it more easy to use by the user. Next is Google Panda website should allow to log in using more ways like Google account, mobile number, and guest login. And in the help center part, the description can be added to the help center section with detail about the feeder. And for the Google Map API is that can provide the ordering tracking that allow the customer to have constant access to their order detail. Now I will list out three comments with the clear justification on the current Food Panda website in any aspect. First, there are no real contact between staff and customer when there are any issues related to the food ordering. Second, changing and cancelling the food is simple when users have ordered the food online. And Third, is the user interface friendliness need to be improved because user might need quite a long time in order to understand how to use the system. Finally, there are some suggestions for the future enhancement for the Food Panda website. First, in the aspect of contact, we suggest the Food Panda website will provide a chat box to communicate between the customer and the seller so that customer can ask for details about the food that is selected and the customer can decide to order it or not. Second, in the aspect of changing and cancelling the food, we suggest the Food Panda website can set a specific time limit for the customers to cancel the order so that both parties do not lose anything. It is because there are some customers who request for a cancelling order when the rider are on the way to pick up the food. And lastly, in terms of user interface, we suggest the Food Panda website to make it more simple and easier so that all the users in different ages will know how to use it. That's all from us. Thank you.